So my inspirations for glass art come from the sun, from the sky, from mountains, from music, from visions that I've had in yoga class, from out-of-body experiences, from dreams I've had, stories I've read and people that I've met. Living life is a really rich environment and I just can't get enough ideas into glass. So I make glass art because I can't find any material more beautiful. Transmitted light through glass is so powerful for me that I can't look away from it. I can't spend my time doing anything else. So my particular glass is unique because I really like to experiment. I'm always trying new ideas. Typically in a month I might try five techniques that I've never tried before. I don't like to try techniques I've seen other glass blowers use. I like to only experiment with things new to me and new to glass. I feel that good art is made after only we take in a lot of input from different positive sources. So then my job is to rework those sources through my own lens and turn those into a new beautiful expression. If anyone examines a very small area of anything, of my hand, of my shirt, of gravel, of dirt, you will find literally dozens of colors. And I don't see the point really to eliminating all that from the artwork that I make. One thing I like to make are glass lights. Light shades that change colors are very fun for me, but also custom pieces that fit into people's homes specifically. It's very exciting for me to create pieces that then will complement someone's living space that they'll get to enjoy every day. So there are generally two types of glass I enjoy creating. One are the functional pieces such as lights or vessels. One are exhibition pieces that really come from dreams and concepts, experiences I've had, places I've been, people I've met. These pieces to me are so exciting that I can create a body of work not based on what might sell, but only on what needs to be born. I'm very excited about an entire series that I've created, but one piece in particular is called Portal to the Clouds of God. It was inspired by an out-of-body experience that I had. About 15 years ago, I actually left my body and experienced God directly, which was fantastic. I searched for about eight years to start to find some designs that reminded me of that experience. And then in the last two years, I've really, really been able to uh, call forward the vision that I had and express that through transmitted light through glass. So this piece that I've created on the one face with reflected light has lightning bolts and clouds and a midnight blue sky and when it's lit from behind it actually has lit clouds of uh, magentas and almost a rainbow through blues and reds and greens, which is what I actually experienced at that time. When I was young, I set out to be a watercolor painter. I was very excited about the layering of colors, and then I was exposed to colored glass, and transmitted light through glass is so incredibly powerful, exciting, and alive that I realized this is really the material I was born to work with. 